Hey, it's Allison, and I'm recording my makeup for 2017. I've been doing one every year so far, and I don't know how I remember them, but yeah, like I suck at making videos, that's why I don't make them. Enjoy watching it. Okay, first of all, I use this toner. A friend recommended it to me at school, and it's so awesome. It makes you feel refreshed and everything. I just pour that everywhere, so I make it rain on my face. And I know you're supposed to use, like, cotton, but I clearly do not do that. And then after that, I use Neutrogena Sport Face Oil-Free Sunscreen. Yeah, and it's awesome, and it's oil-free, so it's not like gross sunscreen. It actually feels nice on your freaking face. So then I put some here. I like to focus under the eyes because it makes, um, it reduces wrinkles because you're moisturizing down there. And, oh yeah, my hair is green, by the way. I dyed it with Arctic Fox. I use Arctic Fox green something. I'll, like, write it up here. I don't remember what it was. Um, but yeah, then after I moisturize my face, I use a makeup primer. It's an illuminating face primer. And you only need a little bit. And I still stick with Naked Foundation. I still do, like, the dot method. And I use this to make the end of my beauty blender moist. Moist, oh my god. And then I spread it everywhere. And then I'll go back and like put it on the areas that need it. And then I get my Naked Skin Concealer. Then I do like this weird Then after I do that, I use this. It's the Contour Light to Medium Kit by Anastasia Beverly Hills, which is like my favorite. And I use these two contour brushes I got off Amazon. I don't use the cream contours anymore because they feel really gross and I don't really like that. So these are powders and they're really awesome. Um, I don't really like having it too dark. But yeah, I just use it for a little bit of definition of my face. Like I don't, I don't go all out with it. I don't think. <laughs> so yeah, I use that middle one first. And then after that, I use this darker one just to put it on the outsides of my cheeks. Then I put some over here, not a lot, just a little bit. And then I put some on my upper face. All these girls on YouTube are like experts with what their face is called and I'm just like uh, up here. Like I don't even know what this is called. The temples or something. Um, I use this really yellowish one right here and I put it under my contour as well. And then I get this lighter one and I like to put it on my cheeks. Then I use this fluffy thing because Mm, I already used the powder um, contour for my face, so I don't need to worry about patting it down all the way. So yeah, just use this fluffy thing, go over it once. Sweet. After doing that, I finally use real eyebrow tools. Like, I'm actually using something for my eyebrows. I'm not using eyeliner or whatever I've been using before because now I actually have the Anastasia Beverly Hills um, brow dip pomade and it works well, I love it. Then I use this Urban Decay eyeshadow primer. Then I spread it. And this is my favorite eyeshadow palette. It's by e.l.f. It's so cute. And then I got this eyeshadow brush set. I got it for Christmas and I love it. I get this flat brush. I get this pink color. And I get this lighter brown. Then I get this 
crease brush and I get this dark brown. I'm gonna put it in my crease. Then I get this redder brown and I swipe it. I get this fluffy brush and I just blend it all out. Color design drape sheen, and then I put it on my inner corners. It's great, it's really great. I do this because I want to clean up all like that eyeshadow fallout. I use my favorite on my eyeliner that I've been using since I was 13 or 14. I've tried Kat Von D. Kat Von D sucks. I don't know why people use it. I've tried it, it fades. This one stays on all day. It's great. And I get this really thin, flat brush. And then I do it under my eyes and I flare it out as well. If you don't like spider lashes, you put this on your eyes first and it separates your lashes. It's great. Buy mascara changes like every time I buy a new mascara because I'm trying to find the perfect mascara for me, which I haven't found yet. But this one's all right. It's not my favorite. My favorite one was the mascara butterfly effect eyelash by whoever made it because that was literally almost just like better than sex mascara and I compared them before and they were literally the same so that's probably my favorite so far but yeah this is bombshell volume this came out like 500 years ago it's really awesome because it has step one and step two and right now I'm using step one clearly and my eyelashes are naturally like super long so all mascaras, that's why I switch mascaras all the time because no matter what, my eyelashes are gonna look all right. Okay, that sounded so conceited, I'm so sorry. And I use step two, and I really like to use this e.l.f. Um, highlighter. I get two fingers because it's really glimmery. I don't know if you can see it in this lighting, but it, it's really nice and it looks awesome. And then I put that on my cheekbones. I do it again with these cheekbones. Yeah, you can't really see it, but in the light it looks good. Okay, and I finished it up with this sheer gloss I got from Victoria's Secret. It's ten dollars. It's not worth it. Don't buy it. But I had they were on sale, so I bought it. Just don't buy it. It's so stupid. And it literally looks just like lip gloss. There's nothing special about it. It's just overpriced for no reason. You can literally buy one at the Dollar Tree and it'll look the exact same. Try not to put it on your skin, even though you think you can't see it. When you go out into the light, it'll literally look like you're slobbering and that's so gross. My mom has this problem. No offense, mom, it just looks really bad. And I usually don't do anything with my hair, although it is straightened right now. And that's pretty much it. Follow my Instagram, Malachite, M-A-L-L-I. C-H-I-T-E. It's my favorite gemstone. This is Malachite. It's so awesome. And yeah, so follow me on Instagram and it'll be awesome. Thank you.